Hey guys, Shadow's back. Um, today in Lunar Magic, we'll be learning how to edit the title screen, and that's pretty much it. So if we go over in the, in the overworld editor, this is also how you know if you have the real Lunar Magic. But you go in the little overworld ed editor. If you don't know how to get there, you skip one of my videos. This is part three for those who didn't know. And you go to overworld editor. You got a file uh, and title screen. And then you and then you go load title screen or F11. And also, if you change the overworld map, like I showed you in the last video at all, you want to save it before before you go there because if you don't, it'll this will erase it. So you go there and this the here's the title screen. All right. Um, it will say Super Mario World, but say you don't want it to say that. Say you want it to say let's just let it say something else. Let's just retype Super Mario World. You don't type though. So if you click on the little iceberg like I just did, you get this little box. And if you just click the down key, you can just you can just if you just if you click that or push the uh, page up or page down. Here we go. Hmm. And you, you can switch between palettes. I rather just do this. So, yes, yeah, so let's go with palette. Mm, I like palette number seven. So let's get rid of this. And this, and this time you can push the delete key. You highlight all this and delete. You can just do that. All right. Now let's just put Super Mario World back in. So we're gonna find the um, find it. Right click. Again, this might take you some time, but it's a lot easier than editing the world. S U P E and R and we're gonna put Mario in there. Oh, here's the word Mario. We're gonna just highlight this entire oh M that half piece that half piece and you're just gonna keep on going with this. Super Mario um, and then we're just gonna put in world. Um, oh, oh, no, delete. Um, why do I keep saying um? I know what I'm doing. O R. Um, there I go again. L and D. All right, Super Mario World. And that's how you would do it. You can also add these little pictures on the side. And you can just keep going up. You can even add pictures, I think. Yes, 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 you can. Um, oops. Let's just right click, click the blue. Yeah, there you go. You just click blue and right click anywhere. And also, guys, if you make your own game, you might want to get rid of. You never mind. Don't get rid of because that shows it's not your game. <laughs> but that's how to edit the title screen. And normally you would just save that, but it was, I'm gonna click this to re reload it. No. All right, and we get the overworld again. Let me just close out the overworld. And I'm gonna show you one more thing before we go. Lunar Magic. Um, really quick. The the screen exits. No, no, that's the next video. I'll wait till the next video to do that one. But um, if we go to this little Mario head, um, we're going to change the music. Go to the little Mario head. You, this is where you can change stuff. This is where you can say vertical scrolling. I won't you. Know, Vertical scroll at will that you like. Whenever Mario jumps or goes off the screen on top, he, the camera will follow him. I'm just gonna leave this. Here's the music. You can just play around with the music until you get more. Um, there are more options. I won't mess with the screen thing. There are more options. I think it's in. Where is it? Um, no. Here we go. Uh, you can also click on the music thing and bypass time limit 
and you can set the time limit. And this is all the music you can get on the Mario World. So that's how to change the title screen and the music for a level. This has been Shadow Spark, and goodbye.